Let's explore the intersection of meditation and anxiety. Contrary to what the self-help book of the day might say, anxiety is not an indictment. What we feel does not make us a failure or a success. Does it not make us a sinner or a saint? does not make us a fiend or a fool. The question is not, if we, are we feeling something unpleasant? The question is number one, are we aware of what we feel? Are we ex exercising the vulnerability to really let ourselves feel whatever pleasurable or painful, emotional or physical sensation that may be crossing our path. And then what are we doing with it? Are we using the emotional intensity to actually fuel our meditation? Remember, upon the path of the Tao, we do not fall into the trap of active concentration, but passive awareness. We marry our passive awareness with our in-breath. We also marry our relaxation or our acquiescence with our out-breath, with our exhalation. And so without forcing our breath, just being in harmony with our natural breathing, we can notice whatever we're experiencing in the present moment and relax into it. Whatever we're experiencing, whatever pain we're experiencing, physical or emotional, can always be multiplied if we only resist it. <laughs> Luckily, the opposite is true. The pains we experience can be minimized as we acquiesce into them, not fatalistically, not in a scattered way, but in a centered way. My name is Lama Jigme Gyatso, and this is the Buddha Joy Meditation School.